So we're going to have a quick look at the X-Flight Autopilot today. It's very easy to use. Um, you can see the AHRS display there with um, miles per hour, ground speed up there, altitude up there. This is the distance from the home location. This would be the track to home location and this is current track. Now the, uh, there are three modes to the autopilot. Um, first of all, switch it on. Stability um, is a wings level mode and keeps the wings straight and level. Cruise mode keeps you on your current track and maintains altitude as well. And then the home setting steers you onto um, the home vector. Uh, so this is the home vector and this is your current track and so you'd be tracking towards the home vector right now and um, it has a configurable maximum bank angle to get you there. Also you've got a status in the middle there that tells you the status of the flight controller and um, whether you're uh, in the home location or not. When you're within two miles of the home location then this will start flashing and the autopilot will maintain you in a loiter circle around the home location until you disengage the autopilot. So it's uh, very easy to use. Um, this also shows you the number of satellites locked on. Uh, we're in a hangar at the moment but it's showing uh, 18 satellites at the moment. So this is a typical servo installation. This is uh, to control the pitch so it's within the elevator control surface controlling the elevator trim tab. The servo is mounted within the elevator control surface uh, on the bottom there. It's screwed into a couple of aluminium blocks there. Actually they're uh, aluminium, square aluminium tubing with wooden dowel inside and the screws hold the servo in there. And the slot there allows the arm to go out to the control linkage. If you don't have room inside the elevator then you can also mount the servo on the outside. And look underneath, you can see the servo arm coming out of the slot, connecting to the linkage and connecting to the trim um, horn to move the trim tab. It's a very simple setup and works very well.